Hi Piscean, welcome back to my channel. We are doing your next 48. This is going to be episode May 7 and 8 for Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. So let's see what the important, important messages are for you. Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. What are the important messages for you? Let's see. All right, let's, these cards are falling out, Pisces. So here you are, Eight of Cups. That's definitely you. Um, first deacon of your sign. We have the King of Swords and we have the Seven of Pentacles. Okay, so it looks like, and we have the Empress, okay? Your Highness, Libra Taurus. We have Libra showing up here again. So it looks like this could be about a friend, somebody who's a platonic friend. You're, you're having a conversation, very intellectual conversation. All right, you're, you're, I'm, I'm getting you could be spending time with this person too, maybe even shopping or just discussing facts, having a conversation. All right, somebody, whoever this is under the deck, this Empress card, somebody's watching you or somebody thinks very highly of you. All right, somebody sees you as this Empress. Okay, so what is the Seven of Pentacles? It's almost, it's almost like somebody upsets you, Piscean, and you and you go to this air sign to, um, to, you know, to talk to them. Like, oh my gosh, I just need to talk to somebody. Because it's like you're running to the air sign. You're running to the uh, air sign to talk, maybe about your situation, what you're going through. What's the Seven of Pentacles? What is the Seven of Pentacles? Or maybe you're just exhausted with work or whatever, with just with life. You're just over it. You're like, oh my God, I'm just so over this whole day. I'm just over everything. All right. Okay. We have the Knight of Wands showing up. Yeah. So you could be upset because you want more sex. You want more attention. You want more excitement. Something is dry. It's dead. It's boring. It's not moving. The Eight of Cups, you're fed up. You're tired. You, you want more excitement in your life. You want more sex. Or whatever this is. You want to have more fun. I'm getting you want to be more of a free spirit. Okay. So that could be why you're running away. Oh, sorry about the glare, you guys. Okay. What's the eight of cups? What are you What are you running away from? Or what? It, what's exhausting you? What's the eight of cups, please, for Piscean? All right. Let's see. Eight of cups. Okay. The ten of wands. So you're walking away from a burden, which is good. You're dropping your burdens. Something that was exhausting that you were carrying, you're, you're finally walking away from that. Thank God. Okay, I'm, I'm getting the King of Swords is helping you. It could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So you could be talking to this person and he's telling you, hey, you can leave. You can you can walk away. You're done. You're done here. So this could be your boss or someone. What's the King, what's the king of Swords doing? Who is this person? All right. So it looks like you're, you're able to walk away from a responsibility that was um pretty shitty anyway that you didn't you weren't really enjoying this it's like something you were carrying a burden all right something was uh, weighing very heavy on you you're finally able to walk away from that what's the king of swords we have the page of cups so say it looks like somebody is greeting you so somebody could be actually getting out of jail this i'm getting like the ten of wands is like bars somebody could be getting released from jail or just released from something and somebody here, is here to greet you and meet you somebody is giving you um you know very sweet hi how you doing Okay, an older gentleman or an older woman. All right, what are they saying to you? What's the page of cups? Whatever it is, you are happy with the sun card. You're happy about this. Okay, so it could be it could be actually a fire sign that's you know standing there waiting on you. Okay, what is the uh, page of cups energy? I'm also getting to like some something is really stressing you out. You're just you just like talk. This person's easy to talk to. You can run to them when you need some, somebody to um, co you know, console you or comfort you or just make you feel better. All right, this person's very sweet, very innocent, kind of a very shy energy between the both of you. I'm not. I'm getting a little bit of flirtation, but it's not sexual. With the Knight of Wands in reverse, there's no sexual energy between you and this person. There may not even be any attraction, but you, they're just easy to talk to. You can run to them when you need somebody to talk to, a shoulder to cry on, but they don't come at you in a sexual way. I'm getting a platonic friend. Okay, maybe somebody who's even in the military, a military member, all right, because the, uh, the king of swords to me is like somebody who's in, the, he's in a uniform, he's in the military, he's a sergeant, you know, he's very uniform, very professional, very intellectual, someone who's, someone who's not going to come at you in a sexual way, this could be, it could be an Aquarian, okay, somebody who doesn't, you know, they can, they just, they're okay with just talking to you, you know, just, they want to know what happened, they're like, they're like, what's wrong, tell me about your day, what happened? And you're just like, oh, okay. What's what is the play? What is the page of cups? Page of cups. Page of cups energy. Okay, yeah. So what this is a friend. This is what this is. So if you're if you're watching, if you're cross watching, you're wondering about this air sign. This is a friend. 
There's nothing to worry about here. And I'm getting it's moving very slow. You guys may have been friends for a long time. This is a very, very slow build. It's not a sexual connection at all. Okay, I'm getting you've known this person. It's not a new friend because the King of Swords is a very high swords card. All right, but they help you move on. They ease your mind. They help you go from being upset to being calm. All right, so I like this energy. All right, very mature. This even could be your father. All right, what's the, what is the Ten of Wands? What, is, what was stressing you out, Piscean? All right, what's stressing you out? It could be a, a fire sign that's stressing you out, a Sagittarian. All right, what is the, what is the Ten of Wands? Okay, the Four of Cups. Now, this could also, too, be maybe somebody is, like, stressing you out about this platonic friend. They may think it's they may think it's a sexual connection there, but it's not. You're like, look, we're just friends. He's just my friend. And I'm getting, they, he is just a friend, but I'm getting, too, um, you're just bored. You just want some excitement. Maybe this, this person is just like a breath of fresh air when you're bored or whatever. Okay, what's the Knight of Wands in the reverse? This is a very basic reading. All right, what is the Knight of Wands in the reverse? I'm getting you're stressed out because you're bored, Piscean, or you're in a rut. Okay, what is the what is the Knight of Wands in the reverse? Or are you just you're not you're not maybe you're not having sex. You want more sex? Maybe that's the thing you want to be touched. Okay, yeah. The, what, no, I, wow, I spoke too soon. It's not about that at all. I'm just I'm just. It's not about sex either. You don't you're not feeling any type of way about sex. I'm getting you don't even want sex. It's just about pure conversation. Maybe you just want attention. You want to feel beautiful. You want to feel sexy. You want someone to tell you that or whatever. Maybe just, I don't know. It's just something about this person. You just like talking to them. All right, very very simple, basic message. It's not about sex at, at all. I'm getting, I'm getting the physical attraction is not even that deep here. There may be something there, but it's not deep at all. But they do make you happy. They make you laugh. Okay, you can tell them your secrets. You can tr That's what it is. You can trust them. They listen to you. You can tell them your secrets. All right, so this is somebody that you trust. This period. I'm getting a conversation with a friend here. All right, I want to do one more spread for you because that was very specific for a specific person. All right, so let's see. That's good. This is somebody that you can trust, Piscean, a friend of yours. All right, maybe some a very professional person. Okay, I'm going to do one more spread for you. One more spread, please. One more spread for Piscean, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. All right, let's see. We have the Four of Swords. We have the Page of Swords. So more air. This air sign is, you really like this air sign, and this air sign really likes you. Okay, the Queen of Swords, though. All right, so more air. A lot of communication with this air sign. But I'm getting this time, you're not, something is, something is going on here. <laughs> okay, it's almost like you're waiting to say something. Okay, what's the Queen of Swords in the reverse? Now, this could be a different air sign. This because Last time it was a King of Swords. This is a, this is a different energy. It's feminine. All right, so you could be dealing with two air signs that are very significant to you in your life. All right, what is the, what is the uh, queen of swords energy? What's the queen of swords energy? In the reverse, please. Okay, we have the ten of cups falling out. So that's what I'm getting. I'm getting the same energy here. So it looks like you're just, it looks like you're just having a bad day. You're pissed off. You're stressed out. You're, you're working a lot. You have a lot on your plate, Piscean. Okay, you need somebody to talk to. You're just stressed, and I'm getting this air sign is coming to the rescue. What's the page of swords? This, I'm getting this person has been watching you, or you have been watching them. They're looking at you. Okay, what is what is the page of swords? Yeah, the seven of pentacles. All right, and what is the four of swords? So the same energy is coming out. The four of swords, please. Okay, the six of cups. Yeah, so it's I'm I'm getting I'm getting your off. You're, it's your day off, or you're just taking a break, and you're just kind of bored. All right. But I'm getting like you're watching TV, or you're watching reruns, and you're laughing. Maybe even with this person, you guys are watching reruns or something like that. You're just kind, I'm getting you're just kind of laying here, like watching TV, but not really paying attention. Kind of like in La La Land, daydreaming, maybe like fantasizing. You could be like un intoxicated by seeing. And we do have the, the Knight of Swords in the reverse. Yeah, so it's almost like a day of relaxation. After you talk to this air sign, it's like you're calm, you're cool, you're collected. All right, this air sign really has a way of getting to you. All right, so I'm going to leave it there. Don't forget to like the video, leave your comments, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.